Stu Pat, good to see you. Possibly, possibly games at some point in the future. I get motion sick and sit 30 frames per second. So does my wife. She cannot do those games. My ex-wife, when we played when we played Doom the first time, we played it in the dark. And when when the you know, like those fireballs, like the, the evil monsters would throw at you. I kid you not, this is my ex-wife. I swear to God, she was so funny. My my universe, my my college buddy and I, we were laughing our asses off. We were almost peeing our pants because it was the first time. We, the, the, it was all dark, and we I, I worked in the computer lab, so we snuck into the computer lab after hours and brought our dates in. Shh, don't tell anybody. It was awesome. The privileges of having access to the computer lab at night. And obviously, we couldn't afford any of those computers to play Doom on. In 1996? Five? That happens at all labs. <laughs> so we were like, seriously, though, she had such, like, she couldn't play it. It made her sick because she was like, she was a dancer too. So it was, she was really cued in visually to everything. And so she, so she was like ducking. She was, she would literally duck and scream. And we're like, you're gonna, somebody's gonna find us. And she's like, ah! It's funny. Oh my god. It was so funny. Oh, so. Oh yes. College days. Good old college days. Perks of working a lab. Which is why I built my own lab downstairs. <laughs> and now with COVID, we can't play it anymore. God damn it. So yeah. I know. I know. Just know. Actually, I might have to play a horror game. And then do a full on Markiplier. And turn the lights down. And play horror games. I, the problem is, your guys' ears would get totally blown out because I would. I don't have a condenser mic, so all of my like volume spikes would blow your ears to pieces. 